Starting for the first time at the tournament following injury, Borussia Dortmund striker Haller connected with a Max Allen Gradle cross in the 65th minute at the Abimp Olympic Stadium, his shot looping over the goalkeeper and in. That was enough to settle a tense but open semi-final showdown, and the Ivorians will now face Nigeria at the same venue on Sunday to decide who takes the title. The two-time champions are the first host country to reach the final of the Cup of Nations since Egypt in 2006, and the turnaround is absolutely remarkable for a team that was on the brink of elimination in the group stage. In contrast, it was an agonizing defeat for DR Congo, who had been dreaming of a first appearance in an AFCON final since they were champions as Zaire in 1974. Ivory Coast's run at the tournament had been described on the eve of this game as miraculous by their own interim coach Immerse Faye, the men who replaced the sacked Jean-Louis Gasset following embarrassing results in the group stage, humiliated and on the verge of elimination after a 4-0 defeat by Equatorial Guinea on January 22, this was their first match at the Abimp Olympic Stadium on Abidjan's dusty outskirts since then.